Blake Berman, thank you. Well, now what? Millions of us, including me, have cars with Takata airbags in them. Let's bring in Lauren Fix, the car coach. Actually, Lauren, I'm not sure I do, but I do drive a Toyota Lexus, and I saw the logo. I saw it as included there. What do I do to find out if I need that fixed immediately? Well, first you need to get your vehicle identification number, and that's the number that's right where the windshield meets the dash. And you can write that vehicle number down. You can call either your local dealer or you can go on safercar.gov, and they have slash recalls spotlight, which is Hold car on, give that to, to us to. again. Safer vehicle. It's safer car safercar.gov okay, safer car slash .gov. recalls with an S spotlight and that should have a complete list if you don't see your vehicle on there and you're still concerned call your local dealer ask for the service department give them the vehicle identification number known as a VIN number and they can look it up if you find it online I highly suggest printing it out and bringing it with you to the dealer because we've had situations where the dealer doesn't think it's on the list you need to be 100% sure because this is a very serious recall. Lauren, let me read you some breaking news that we just got. Just got. Mm -hmm. The Takata CEO is now speaking about this, and he is saying that the issue behind the problem was not within the scope of testing specifications outlined by automakers. Is he trying to blame the Hondas and the General Motors and the Fords of the world? He's trying to pass the blame for sure. I mean, the manufacturers send out a request for quote, and this is what they expect to get when they place their orders. If a sub company fails to produce that product meeting those specifications, then that's on them. This is something that it's easy to pass off onto the manufacturers, but when there's this many manufacturers and we know that they, they switch their product that's actually doing the discharge to ammonium nitrate, and this is the product that's causing the problem as it degrades because of moisture, and causes these inflators to ignite too quickly. Mm. That's why the metal shards, which is the frame around the airbag that attaches to the steering wheel, that's what's exploding. And this is why we're having a very serious problem. And as far as we can see, it belong, the problem belongs to Takata. Okay, the problem belongs to Takata. Uh, you know the lawsuits might start to happen, but it's better to take it on now versus adding a seventh right. or an eighth death, correct, Lauren? Absolutely. The last thing we want is anyone to get injured or have any deaths. We've already had six deaths, and the injuries have been quite dramatic, as you can see from pictures online. I'm sure you've heard it. They're really upsetting. Okay. I don't know. Can we show the picture that we had earlier of the VIN? I want to just be able to let people know. It's on the driver's side of your vehicle, and it's usually either a little piece of metal that's stamped that's on either the glass part of the windshield. Here it is. Or right there. It's hard to see. So for those right. of us who wear <laughs> specs or, or eyeglasses, get them out there. You've got to right. go look. It's, how many numbers is It's a long number, isn't it, Lauren? It is a long Usually. number. It's also on your registration. It's also on your insurance mm -hmm. card. So if you're not sure and you, you don't have that, your insurance card has it on it. Your registration has it. I'm sure your paperwork, if you leased a vehicle, it's on there as well or if you purchased it. So there's a lot of places to find that vehicle identification okay. number. But that is the critical factor to find if this is one of the vehicles. Okay, owning up. Takata is owning up to it. I'm looking at some stocks here. Toyota's higher, but we do have General Motors, which is slightly higher, not in step with Ford, which is slightly lower, along with Honda, which is slightly lower as well. Here are some car companies right now that are involved. Nissan also down about two-thirds of a percent. Who knows how much this might cost? Doesn't matter. The cost of life is more important. Lauren, thank you very much. Absolutely. Thank you.